There's a problem with posting to social media, and we've all faced it. Let's say you've got this really great idea you want to share on social media, and you want to put it on Twitter. So you open up your Twitter app, and you start scrolling through your messages, and all of a sudden you're diverted. There's just so much content there that it's hard to get your social media message out and get on with life. That's true for all of these services. You open up the application, and you're sucked in for hours. So how do you solve that problem? Drafts. If you've got a great idea you want to share on social media but don't want to get sucked into the time vortex, go in Drafts and list the message, and then use Drafts' built-in services to automatically post it to Twitter, Facebook, or Google+. In fact, using the sharing tools in Drafts, you can put a message on just about any social media service. So stay out of the time vortex and use Drafts to send your social media. Let me show you how to do that. I'm going to go ahead and open up Drafts right now and type in a quick message. Once I'm done, I can hit the Drafts Action button and go over to the Social tab and tap on the social media service of my choice. I'm going to go to Twitter. And just like that, I posted to Twitter. And you can see there it is in the app. While we're on the subject of Twitter, don't miss the Drafts Twitter integration guide that you can find on the Drafts website. Getting back to Drafts, in addition to Twitter, you can use the same method to post to Facebook and Google+. I find the Social tab also a good place to locate some of my custom text messages and emails, especially those that I'm sending to multiple people. Here's one to my kids. If you routinely find yourself posting to social media and don't want to deal with the heavy applications a lot of those companies throw at you, Drafts can solve that problem for you.